Hi, are you looking for the best budget flip screen camera? Well, we'll have it coming right up. Hi everyone, welcome back. My name is Rebecca Meyer. And for those of you that are new to this channel, first let me begin by welcoming you. Um, we predominantly do tech reviews, tutorials, and tips about those awesome tech things. So if you're interested in those things, make sure you hit that subscribe button and uh, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you won't miss anything. As a new YouTuber, I wanted to upgrade my camera gear. I'd previously been using a uh, point and shoot that had a great flip screen. I'd been also using uh, an action cam that had a neat little display, but I, I wanted to actually go into the interchangeable lens round. So what I did was uh, I actually started looking around and I found an amazing camera by Canon. It's called the Canon EOS Rebel SL2. So we're gonna go over that today. So let's talk about the flip screen. This thing is amazing. Uh, it doesn't just turn one way. Like my point and shoot, you could flip it up, which was great, but it, it left it to be a little bit limited, uh, especially if you wanted to hold your camera in different angles and different ways. So especially if like if you're a vlogger or something like that, it's gonna be great because you can hold it in multiple different angles, which is fantastic. Another great feature of this camera is that it actually has built-in time-lapse abilities. So all you have to do is click it on uh, time-lapse and then you're ready to go. And then uh, once you get it into your computer, just plug it in and your time-lapse is already made and you don't, really don't need to do anything at all. Now I know a lot of people have been doing slow-mo recently. I actually think the slow-mo is maybe getting more popular than even the time-lapses. But with this camera, you can actually do that. You can actually film 60 frames per second, which is gonna allow you to get that slow motion feel once you uh, pull back that time on your, on your editor. Another great feature about this camera is that it has creative filters. So if I wanted to change things to black and white, or uh, I use one called Faithful, then it already has it built in. That way I don't have to deal with any color grading. But if I do want to deal with color grading, I do have that options to, to set it at neutral. Um, that way I can do whatever colors uh, I, I want to do on my actual film. Now this camera has Wi-Fi uh, and you'd probably ask yourself, well, why would you use Wi-Fi? I use this all the time. Um, I firstly use it uh, depending on what lens I'm using. I may need to be further back from the camera. Like if I use a 50 millimeter, right now I'm using a 24 millimeter. But if I do use the 50, um, the flip screen is a little bit too far away for me to see. That way I can make sure I'm actually in the frame. Uh, so I can just use it right along with my, with my cell phone. Another great thing is that uh, if you're into social media, you can actually take that information and di uh, directly download it into your phone. That way you can upload it up to whatever social media you need. Now, the flip screen obviously was the most important thing to me, but the second most important thing to me was actually having a mic jack. From going from a point and shoot to a camera with a mic jack, as far as the editing goes, it's mind blowing the amount of time it saves me when editing. Uh, previously I had to sync up the, the video versus the audio and that really is a pain and, and especially in our daily lives as we're going and going it's really hard to to get that 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 time to do the editing that you need to do hey guys thank you so much for watching today if you did enjoy this video make sure you hit that like button and leave me a comment down below uh, what camera are you using do you have one with the flip screen what do you think is important in, uh, in, in finding the, the perfect camera? And if you want to see more content like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button and, and ring that notification bell. That way you don't miss anything. All right, guys. Thanks again for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. Peace out. Keep shining.